Stands that would be useless in part one of JoJo's. Number one, red hot chili pepper. Look around, it's the 1880s. Where the hell is the electricity in Dio's castle? The fight with Tarkus and Bruford. Where's the electricity? Since there's no electricity, chili pepper can't really get any power and thus is just kind of fodder. Number two, Paisley Park. It wouldn't be completely useless, but it would be significantly weaker than how it was in part eight. With no technology such as GPSs or phones to guide the stand user, stand's ability is significantly weaker. The main power, not its only power, is to manipulate electronics and, you know, guidance. What electronics is it going to manipulate in the Stone Age. Number three, Superfly. This stand is already kind of ass, but think about it. There's no electrical pylons. Electrical pylons weren't invented till 1928, so what would the stand even be? Like a lightning rod or something? I, I don't know. So the stand can't even exist yet, meaning it's useless. Number four, Bastet. Same concept as Superfly. Since there's no electricity pylons, there sure as hell is no electricity outlet. If Mariah could activate a magnetism some other way, it'd be viable, but there's not, so well, it can't exist, can it? Thanks for watching. Like and follow if you agree. Tell me about some other stands that will be useless in part one, and check out my YouTube channel for other stupid content.